Increasing production of synthetic plastics results in the accumulation of these materials in the environment. Due to their resistance to various environmental factors, synthetic plastics represent serious pollutants accumulating in the environment. As a result, bioplastics are being paid a significant amount of attention. These materials are very similar to synthetic plastics in terms of their mechanical and technological properties. On the other hand, unlike synthetic plastics, bioplastics are fully biodegradable. Their decomposition under natural conditions lasts only a few weeks or months. Microbial fermentation is a very promising approach to bioplastic production. Some bacteria are capable of transforming their food into polymeric storage materials called polyhydroxyalkanoids. The most widespread material of family of polyhydroxyalkanoids is a homopolymer of 3-hydroxybutyrate, polyhydroxybutyrate. The mechanical properties of polyhydroxybutyrate resemble polypropylene. Nevertheless, polyhydroxybutyrate is fully biodegradable and biocompatible, which opens up many potential applications. V naší laboratoři jsme vyvinuli komplexní technologický postup pro přípravu takzvaného bioplastu, což je ekologická varianta ropných plastů a do pomoci speciálních bakteriálních kmenů. The bacteria are able to use various sources including cheap and waste substrates. In our laboratory, we have focused on the utilization of waste cheese whey or waste frying oils. The polymer content within the bacterial cell can reach more than 80% of its weight and the concentration of cells during fermentation might exceed 100 grams per liter. Incorporation of other monomer units into a polymer structure significantly improves the mechanical and technological properties of the resulting materials. By controlling the conditions of bacteria fermentation, we are able to influence the monomer composition of polymer, and moreover, we are able to partially enhance its molecular weight. When the fermentation process is completed, the cells are removed from the cultivation media and disrupted. The cellular components other than polyhydroxyalkanoids are removed to gain pure polymer. This process has to be designed in order to prevent polymer degradation. Thanks to their mechanical properties, biodegradability and biocompatibility, polyhydroxyalkanoids find a number of applications in the fields of packaging industry, agriculture, or medicine. The spectrum of potential applications can be significantly spread. By using an electrospinning process, it is possible to fabricate nanofibers based on polyhydroxyalkanoids. The utilization of microbial technology for the production of polyhydroxyalkanoids represents a promising path heading from cheap waste towards high-tech applications.